Cole asked a very good question about the collage of whether if you forgot to put an image in, if you could add it. So let me go over that briefly. The first thing I'll do is I'll go ahead and hide the personal information. Let's go up and bring up the image organizer and I'll go to the filter and I'm going to just filter the pictures that I took today. I'm look at all of them. So this is just the pictures that we took today. So this is just basically a case I just finished. Click on all patients. And then this comes up. So these are the pictures that I took this morning. But what I really want to look at is all of the pictures. So I'll view patient images. The image organizer splits into two. So I have uh, all of the pictures from the entire case. I double click on that to bring it full screen. And then I'm just going to select some pictures. I've already chosen them in the order that I want to save time. So let's say I take these and I want to put these into a collage. So I come up to the collage. We publish it. I double click it to bring it large. And then let's say I want to have two pictures per page. So I go up to my template, two pictures per page. And it creates four pages with two pictures on each one. But as I do this, I realize, you know, I really want on this first page, I want the picture of the radiograph in it as, as well. So all you to answer Cole's question, yes, you can add a picture to any page that you want or create additional pages by adding. But let's say I want that one picture in this particular page. What I would do is I would double click on the collage to bring the image organizer up in the background. I would take my radiograph. I would choose the picture. And it's important uh, when you're putting these collages together, I don't even have to be in this patient's record. I could be in my lectures or library as well. I take I select the picture, I click it, and I just drag it in to the to the to page one. And there it is. Now you've got a positioning problem. So what I want to do is I want to have this first page a three pick per page picture, but I don't want to affect these next two pages. So what I'll do is double click on the collage again, and then I want to change this to a three pick per page, but I don't want to change these other pages. So all I do is go up to the template, select three picks per page, but I only want to apply it to the current page. I don't want to affect the pages uh, after this. So I click that and now it puts the three picks per page. My other pages are still two picks per page. Now let's say on the last page I wanted to add another picture. So let's do it again. I double click on the collage. Now I can see the image organizer in the background. I want to show how we trim this back with an ultrasonic tip. I bring it in. It's there. I go to the template and I say three picks per page. I want to apply it only to the current page. And there it is. Now let's say I want to add some pictures. So I click add. It adds a page five. I go to page five and now I want to select That's five. One, two, three, four. I select four picks. Bring them in. And then do my four pick per page. I want to apply it only to the current page. And there they are. Now I have the pages exactly as I want them configured for picks per page. Hope that answers Cole's question.